G'day guys, welcome back to another episode here. So today myself and Ryan, we've woken up with absolutely no plan as to what we're doing. Not a clue what we were gonna do. We just jumped in the car and figured, bugger it, let's get going. So we decided we'll hit a completely new zone that we've never really been to before at all. And safe to say, it's really, really hectic. So I'll play that footage there for you now. What I've done is just chuck the drone up. So I'll give you a look at that as well. And I'm just taking a bit of a breather on the inside now because it's bloody cold and windy. So once I chill out for a bit, I'm going to get back out there, see if we can get some more fish and see what happens for the afternoon. But magic place, magic part of the world and hopefully this afternoon just turns it on. Yay! Oh, my full front front wheel was just like. Your back left was off the ground. Oh man, that's sick. We made it. on you has he got friends oh I'm getting hit oh there's heaps of them man what are, are they little jays There's heaps of them there, man. Yep, oh! <laughs> oh, what? Have yeah, I got a trout? Yeah. Oh, he's right. actually caught on the rock. Yep. Stay there. Oh, no. oh he's gone! <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> he looks like a cool trout. Yeah, hold on. Hold on, we'll get this in. One sec. Twenty 
centimetre trout. Yeah. Don't you forget it either. I won't. Oh, I thought it was a little G, so I was like, ah, oh, he's not going to run me across the ledge. Turns out he did. Because it wasn't a G. Um, I don't know. I think we're wasting valuable time though. Oh, let's go. Rods up and walk. <coughs> I'll follow you. Oh, this is so cold. Oh, wow. Oh, current. Lots of current. Oh, floating bag. <laughs> current taking bag. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Oh, I'm a big, I'm a big stick bait right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a floating stick. <laughs> want to see the? We've gone the... five meters. <laughs> Can you do a big pop for me? It'd be a big floating popper. <laughs> big sweep. Cut the bottom, dude. Neither. The bag's taking it. Oh shit! I'm doing froggy legs. <laughs> Dude, I can't touch the bottom. Neither, I'm full kicking. Ah. All right, swim time. Go back to the shore. Very dangerous. Shore reassess. Very dangerous. Too much current. Drifting out the sea. Lots of current. Drifting out the sea. How are you moving? I can't even touch the bottom. <laughs> like, <laughs> the whole floating bag, very good. Save your life. Not when there's lots of current. <clears throat> Drift out from here. Yeah. Because I couldn't actually stay on the ground. No, neither. It was just... And the current <clears throat> is so heavy, dude. Really heavy. We need to go back and have a look at where this actual bank is so we can get out. It doesn't look that bad. Maybe if we start over there, we'll end up over there. Alright, let's do that. <laughs> oh. That's real deep. Really deep. Really cold. Oh, that sounded nice. I had to undo my bag because it's going to take me. I was like ready to let go of the bag. Really? Oh, yeah. Take two. Up to the nipples already. Yep. I loved how when we were doing that last bit, it was like... Hope, let's hope take three isn't one of us getting taken. Nah, we'll be right. They just want to cuddle. Getting deeper again. Deeper. But it should be getting shallower. Look at that. Oh, I'm a. Oh, no, shallow. Deep. Oh, you go shallow. Deep. deep. <laughs> okay, we've almost made it. Coming up the ramp. We've done it. We've bloody done it. Oh. Wow, so soft. <laughs> oh yes, we've made it! Very big Raymond. Cruising? Oh, he's a big Raymond. Oh, big cod. Oh, Mandy Cod. On the drop. Oh, yes, right there. Is that a little cod? That's a little codly boy. Hey, buddy. Is that your trout bomb you just there, is it? Where? Straight yeah. directly me? Yeah. Bring it over the top, sink. Oh, he's, oh! Did he have a go? Yeah. <laughs> Every time, eh? Oh, you just feel the, the big donk. Try again. All right, 
over the top, coming over the bombing now. Sink. Oh! Wow! Alright, I'm leaving him alone. Huh. Big codly boy. <laughs> oh! Where's it go? Oh, can you grab the rod? Grab the sliding. Oh, fire out. <laughs> Almost lost him. Saying someone's had a big chomp of it. What do you reckon? You reckon it's a big chomp? <laughs> Surely someone would have gotten there and eaten it, but. knows what this is. Can you please holler? Look at that star on the other side of it. Yeah. Holy hell. Look at the size of it. That thing is so bloody big. I can put my whole arm in there. That's a great little haven for fish to live in as well. As that tide pushes up, the water comes over the top of that. Little fish and crabs and all that kind of stuff protect them from anything that does want to eat them. Really, really cool. I've never seen one that big before, but it's incredible. There's so many sea cucumbers and everything around here. It's insane. Very, 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 very special part of the world, this. This here should stay hold water, which is why you get all these little sea cucumbers that are living in here. Uh, purely because, of, sorry, purely because of the fact that there's always water in here, even on the lowest of tides, there's still going to be water in here so they can always sustain life. Uh, whereas other places all through the system here, some, some of it does get completely bone dry, but all these little tiny stuff, there's still a coverage of water at the moment. So lots of little, little things can sustain life in here. That thing is really cool. There's two of them, they're huge. But yeah, really, really cool little zone.